I'm using rainbow trout and I'm swimming them at different speeds, different obstructions, not obstructions, determining if it's more cost effective for them to swim with an obstruction, without an obstruction, or groups of fish or by themselves. This is my first experience doing the research. It's helped me a lot. It's gave me a lot of lab experience, which I've never had before. Um, that's a main, one of the main reasons I did this, but it also gets gets myself to know the professors on a personal level more or less than a cl classroom level. The group atmosphere that we come together on Thursdays, and you get to know a lot of people, a lot of students from different majors as well. I think the major goal of, of the summer research program in the last couple of years has been to sort of expand the definition of research at Widener and undergraduate research. And we really do think of it as a scholarly activity, whether that's traditional research in the sciences or engineering or book editing in English. Any project where the faculty and the students collaborate on some question in their field is sort of how I would define research. One of my research partner, Tom, created a map. From that data, he localized a hotspot, which you can find French speakers. So based on that, we were able to locate a community partner in Opa Darby. So a part of our project is directed to help prepare them for doctor's appointment, for nutrition problems, some people like stress management. For me, I love it. It's interesting. You help them. They're always happy. Always the smile at the end, the thank you, even the small little thing that you do, for me, is really rewarding. I really did struggle academically freshman year. I mean, at one point I was like, maybe I shouldn't even be here type of thing. It was an honest thought. Um, and then sophomore year, I came back. I was trying pretty hard. I had a lot of honest conversations with uh, Dr. Coughlin at the time, um, who really kind of was encouraging to me. And he said, why don't you try doing some research that might you know, help you kind of get more into your, your studies. And it turns out it was true because I think when we study biology as a freshman, you know, you read about what is a protein gel? And you just read about it, but it's something about doing it. I think that was important for me, like having that real world experience and then going back and studying was like meshing those two things together. Your future is soon, sooner than you think, and, it, and you only have a couple years to, to change it or to uh, make yourself into the person you want to be. And don't be scared, come in, ask people. If you don't have it, if you don't know, ask. I mean, there's many people that will lead you to research that, that'll help, your, help you gain your knowledge and help you uh, become a better person.